Hi, it's Heok here from Ondol, and today I would like to talk about moxibustion, which is a very important part of our acupuncture treatments. And a lot of people always ask, what is moxibustion? So in our clinic, we do mainly three forms of moxibustion, and I will go through them uh, step by step. So first of all, the word moxibustion derives from the Japanese word moguza, which means burning of mugwood. And it is a traditional oriental medical technique that involves the burning of mugwood, a particular tinder of dried herbs on or near the skin to facilitate healing. It has been used throughout Asia for more than 3,000 years and was first practiced in cold climates to generate warmth for the body and to reduce pain. The purpose of moxibustion, as with most forms of traditional oriental medicine, is to build and strengthen blood, improve circulation by stimulating the flow of energy, which is called qi, and obtain through that health. The first moxibustion method I would like to talk about is Ocumoxa. And the moxa has the size of a rice corn or even smaller, and it is directly placed on the skin uh, over an acupuncture point. And then the practitioner lights um, the top of the moxa with an incense stick and allows the heat to travel downwards just before it touches the skin and then he, he or she extinguishes uh, the heat. The patient will experience a pleasant heating sensation that penetrates deep into the skin, tissues and muscles without any pain, blistering or scarring. And this form of moxibustion is known for its nourishing and replenishing qualities. Then another form of moxa is the so-called Shinetsuku moxa. In this type of moxa, a much larger cone is used. It has the size of a fingertip and is heated also on the skin on acupuncture points. We use Shinetsuku to tonify and strengthen the chi and to remove the cone when the person senses a slight sensation of heat on the skin. It is a very subtle technique and it supports underlying weaknesses and imbalances of the energy flow or the chi flow. After Shinetsuki Moxa, the patient can feel a deep sense of inner warmth and vitality. A third type of moxa that we use in our clinic is uh, the so-called moxa head needling, whereby a needle is inserted into an acupuncture point in a vertical way and retained. And then a moxa cone is placed on top of the needle shaft and ignited. A soothing heat from the moxa cone radiates into the surrounding area and penetrates the body that way. This form of moxa is used for muscular skeletal conditions and to cover a broader area of an affected area of the body. And it is very pleasant to feel this type of warmth. If you would like to experience the benefit of this treatment, please don't hesitate and call us uh, directly on 33710100 or book directly online on www.ondol.com.au. Thank you so much for watching and listening.